early four in the morning and it's photo shoot day. Let's get ready. skincare. They have caffeine eye patches from the fridge. This is just pure ice and then an ice roller. Let's do it. This is just like the Tower 28th way but cheaper. White head right there. You smell like a latte. It's making me hungry. Like, are you for real? Just gonna like lay some ice on this. I can like feel it. Whatever's in there wants it to come out. Love being a PCOS girly. <laughs> Acne every day. Benjamin wrote me a note. <laughs> and he put it in my ice roller packet. God, I love that man. Ugh. I can literally cry. It's so sweet. I wait for my curling iron to get hot I'm making a little smoothie I put some cold brew coffee in here which if you know me I'm not a coffee gal but I feel like I need a swift kick in the you know what today so I have coffee cacao nibs banana truvani chocolate protein powder which is my favorite and now I'm gonna put in a big scoop of peanut butter I'll just add some water and then blend her up Oh, and I put a whole like boatload of cinnamon in there too, because I love me some cinnamon. That's perfect. That's actually so good. Kelp for my thyroid. Digestive enzymes in my inositol supplement. Perfect concoction.
always look at myself after I get ready and I'm like, I need more blush. Every single time. But it's buried all the way down. I feel like I'm getting ready for a dance competition. <laughs> I'm wearing the loosest stuff that I can possibly find. I'm not even going to put socks on. I think I'm just going to put on like my little Ugg slippers so that there are no lines on my body. I don't know if this is like everybody, but I crease so badly. Like I will have this on for a second and there will be like an indent and it will last forever. So before <laughs> I start taking photos, I wanna make sure I don't have any like creases on my body and that everything is nice and loosey goosey. My bestie Ignacio is picking me up soon. By the way, this from Rare Beauty their um, body and hair mist <laughs> smells amazing. But um, what was I saying? Oh my God, that coffee got me going. There's a reason why I do not have coffee. Ugh. Oh my God, we're going crazy. Anyways, my bestie Ignacio is coming to the photo shoot with me. He'll be here in probably two minutes, so let's go. Okay, this is gonna be so heavy because I have like, workout equipment with me. <laughs> a Pilates ball, a bunch of like ball of bangles, I have snacks. I have a Truvani bar, some almonds. I accidentally spilled this all over my floor last night, so we're just eating whatever's left. And then I have some chopsticks because a girl's got to have her protein. And then in this bag, I have like my makeup and hair products that I'm going to need. Oh, I should bring more hair ties. Oh, I have them in there. I have my curling iron, my sneakers, all my clothes for this part of the shoot. They're gonna be two parts. So one's in a studio. It's all like the fitness workout stuff. It's a loud engine. And then once we're done with that, we're gonna come back here and shoot in my apartment. So I can keep like half of my stuff here, which is nice. Cause otherwise I would literally need like an entire suitcase to come with me, which is crazy. So, we are gonna probably just take this and then I need my sneakers and then I'm gonna go downstairs and see Ignacio. Okay, perfect. I'm just putting my stuff in my bags and then I'll come down and get you. I'm like juggling a million weights, so give me just a moment. <laughs> oh, no, 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 I totally get it. Okay, I'll be right there, but I'm so excited. Do you wanna come drop certain things off? No, no, I only have like two main bags and then just like my mat and like a set of 10 pound dumbbells. So like I should be okay. I do. You sure? Do you need help? I think I'll be okay. If I need help, I'll just, okay. I'll just take it in a trip. Okay. Sounds good. Yay. Okay. I'll see you okay. soon. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Okay. Not as heavy as I thought. This one's gonna, oh, that one's gonna be heavy. Maybe I, the 10 pound dumbbell in this one. <laughs> okay. Oh, I gotta take you guys with me. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> Did you have enough coffee? I had no coffee. This is you just haven't had coffee yet? Rainbows and sunshine. Oh my God. <laughs> Are we getting coffee? Yes, absolutely. Okay, good. <laughs> yes, bestie yes. time. That's it. <laughs> Kill this photo shoot. Got to kill it. Mm, mm, let's mm. go, let's go. I haven't even Behind told Behind every great woman is a gay man saying, yes, bitch. No, actually. <laughs> I, I am that gay man. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't even told them like what I'm doing. So this is, this is crazy. I am starting a brand. By the time you guys are seeing this, it's already been announced, which is even more crazy. It makes me feel like I'm gonna throw up <laughs> and also like butterflies in the stomach I'm just so pumped yeah we're gonna go shoot for the launch for the brand shoot so we have a lot of like fitness things that we're gonna capture today and then 
later on we're gonna go back to my apartment and then shoot a lot of like kitchen um, like cooking aesthetic kind of lifestyle shots so right now we are getting down and dirty with fitness we're going to the studio I have no idea I've never been to this photography studio before so hopefully it's cute let's hope and pray <laughs> and this is the first time I'm meeting my photographer too I found her on Instagram and she seems like a cutie patootie. So far all of the people who I have working on my brand are women, which is really important to me because my brand is like for women. It's for anybody, but people who identify as females and have hormonal issues and just need more guidance. So I had a lot of female power and my bestie. <laughs> Woo! Woo! <laughs> she said, fuck you, Kim. <laughs> How do we feel about the earrings? Like them. Under $30 for all of them. Isn't that crazy? That's a good color gold, too. Right? I love this camera because it makes your skin look perfect. Honestly, it really does. Like, look at that. I look airbrushed. <laughs> <laughs> I look airbrushed. Let's hope Gabby's camera does that too. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Thinking about me every night. Oh, do I look like a Noomba Loomba? <laughs> you just look so much darker than me. Like, I look so Lebanese. Wow. <laughs> we both did the same <laughs> pose. Wow. We both went, wow. <laughs> just wrapped up at the studio it went really well so good. I think we got a lot of great stuff by the way like I'm filming all of this right now what's today April 20th and I'm supposed to sit on all of this content for like three April, months May, June, yeah almost three months almost four almost four months I don't know how I'm gonna do it but um wait what the bridge oh shit can you see this? <laughs> Why is the bridge doing that? Um, but now we are driving back to my place where we're gonna do the second half of the shoot. This one's gonna be really cute. I like styled my kitchen so it looks adorbs. Did you bring the vases or anything? I did. Oh yes. Fuck yeah. I didn't even think to ask you this morning. So oh, I thank it you. Tell me best best <laughs> friend in the world. <laughs> Glass straws and everything. Fuck yeah. For the matcha. For the matcha. I can make you one too if matcha. you want it the mulch. So yeah, we are going to go back to the apartment, get
get some cute lifestyle shots, and then we're going to lunch because we're both starving already. It's like 10 a.m., but I haven't eaten anything. We've both been up since like 4 or 5 ish. Oh my god, 4 in the morning. <laughs> So yeah, we're gonna chow down. I'm honestly already thinking about getting their enchiladas at Beatrix. <laughs> or salad and fries. Enchiladas or salad and fries. Honestly. And en enchiladas. Let's enchiladas. go. Enchiladas. We're going in. We're going in. That's what you have to do after a photo shoot, Hell you know, yeah. after eating like a squirrel. For like two weeks. <laughs> For like, yeah. Well, I can't even say I've been eating like a squirrel. I was just telling Ignacio, like, this is the first photo shoot that I've ever done that I haven't like completely restricted myself. Thank you. <laughs> Beyonce's opera in the background. <laughs> this is the first photo shoot. In the shoot. climactic moment. <laughs> this is the first shoot that I've ever done that I haven't like restricted myself a ton before or like put really you know I don't know strict guardrails on like what I can eat and like how much cardio I have to do I like really haven't done that at all like I was like face down in a bag of gummies like two nights ago and I don't feel bad about it and I'm just you know I'm happy because that's personal growth because that was not the story a long time ago like I used to try to get my body fat percentage so low before a shoot and be like a miserable shell of myself, but that's not the vibe anymore. And it's definitely not the brand that I wanna to promote to anybody else. So I'm like, yeah, real girls have curves. We have little rolls somewhere. We hang a little bit over our athletic wear and that's fine. It's beautiful. Oh, they look so cute. But yeah, we are heading back soon. We have to take the long way back because the bridge, but it's gonna be good. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> I love that she put in a Marvel reference. It's like Avengers are so big even Beyonce felt affected by it. I know. <laughs> At the snap of my fingers of Thanos. <laughs> Somebody changed it to Thanos. T-H-A-N-O-W-L-E-S. Oh and I was like, mm, that is, I, I looked at the lyrics I was like, is that what she said? Okay, that's a wrap. We finished this thing up. How are you feeling, Ignacio? I'm hungry. Hungry as fuck. He's like, let's go, bitch. Let's go. Let's eat. Let's eat. We made a reservation, but we ended like an hour earlier than I thought. So we're going to just try to see if we can fit in to this one restaurant. It is a Saturday around lunch, so hopefully we can oh, yeah. get in. We're going to Beatrix in River North which is my personal favorite. And I'm gonna bring you guys along with me, with us. So let's go. Hello. My apartment looks so cute now that it's like finally aesthetically pleasing. <laughs> Can't always look like this with a man, you know? <laughs> <laughs> but what you're not seeing are the all <laughs> things, like all the clothes that I have to pick up, yeah. We've got a lot to do, but let's go. Cutie. I love the metal, like the metal that you're talking like, like whatever, like. All right, I just got back home. Ignacio left, and I am just like digesting lunch and the whole day. We went to Beatrix in River North, and I got the yummiest Caesar salad with grilled chicken and some fries because there is no better combo. Literally made me a better combo. It's all about balance, you know? I would have filmed it for you guys, but it was packed with people and I didn't want to make anyone feel uncomfortable. So now I'm back. Ignacio left. We are both so tired. <laughs> Um, shoot days are exhausting. They will like take it out of you. 
honestly. I am probably gonna go down to the hot tub in my building and look at all the behind the scenes stuff. It sucks that I have to like hold all this amazing content back, but it's gonna make it that much better when it is finally released out into the world. So I'm very excited for that. Um, but yeah, I am about halfway through Iron Flame. I'm reading it on my Kindle right now, which is the first book that I read on Kindle, which I realize is not a good book to read on Kindle. And I'll tell you why. I love like the feeling of a book getting lighter and lighter and lighter as I turn the pages and make my way through it. It's like addicting. And with a Kindle, you can't really do that. You also can't really like tell how long a book is on a Kindle unless you look down in like the bottom corner of the screen and it'll tell you like what percentage you're through, which is helpful and fun, but it's not the same as like feeling it in your hand. And Iron Flame is such a chunky book. I don't know how many pages there are. I want to say like, oh, don't quote me. I feel like there's about 600 or 700 pages in Iron Flame, something like that. So it's a long book, <laughs> it's long. And I really wish I could like feel myself move through the book. But I decided to kick that one off on a Kindle. But you could also say on the other hand that it's good to read that book on a Kindle because now I don't have to carry around this big book everywhere. So the glass is half full, I'll say that. But anyways, I'm gonna go down to the hot tub, read a little bit and just have some gratitude for the day, reflect on it a bit. It was a really fun day. I love when I get to be creative and expressive and just see everything come together. It like gives me butterflies. <laughs> like I said earlier, it just makes me so excited. I can't wait to share it with the world. But yeah, I'm gonna leave this here. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and I will see you in another one soon.